Hello, everybody, and welcome to a special episode of KTR Watches Something, I guess. Hello. Uh, I'm Colby, joined here by Blake. Me. And Brian. Hello. And, uh, guys, what did we just watch? Barbie Adventure 2. All right. Let's get our general <laughs> thoughts out of the way. Barbie. Ken's a cuck. Ken's <laughs> Barbie could have had more screen time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Listen, we just watched Dragon Ball Super Superhero the dub. Uh, yeah. Uh, after all these months and months mm-hmm. of speculation and trying to hide from spoilers, yes, we finally see it with and, our own eyes. And we just saw it too. It's important. Like we just got back from the theater. Mm-hmm. We decided let's just do it. You know, it's ten thirty. Yeah, let's just record this and then. And, and, Everyone's yeah. looking at their watch. Yeah, everyone got, has to be I'm up in the morning. Napped. Yeah, forced me here by gunpoint. Yeah. I didn't see the movie. <laughs> <laughs> um. So, right before, so this is a spoiler review. Yeah. However, we just gonna give right away our general thoughts, like one sentence, whatever. Yeah, one sentence each. Yeah. Brian um, first. Brian. All right, Brian. About the, what we thought about this movie. Initial thoughts. Brian, go. Pretty and lots of talking. That's not a real sentence. That like doesn't a, have that's to. That's like be. a fragment. It doesn't have to. Well, be. I'll allow it, it was my sentence. All right. All right. If, if you type that into Word, it would have a, a green squiggle yeah, under it. Yeah, would it? <laughs> it would. Yeah. It's already yeah. begun. <laughs> uh, beep, boop, Bobby. <laughs> Colby? Um, my initial thoughts are... Yeah, harder than a thing, huh? It. I had fun watching it with you guys. Oh. Oh. And sound oh. good. That sound good. Blake? I thought it was really cool. Okay. All right. all right. Those are our initial thoughts. Go out and That's see it. That's it, fellas. Um, <laughs> uh, I will ask one more general question. Yeah. Just a yes or no. Mm-hmm. Would you recommend uh, someone go out and see it now in theaters? Yes. Yeah. Yes. I, I would also. All right. Spoilers. Fuck this. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, Pan yeah. so cute. All right, all right. Yeah. Let's just get the elephant out of the room yeah. here. Pan. Yeah. Yeah. Most adorable character. Yeah. You know? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Very like, cute. Killed, yeah. killed it with yeah. her. National treasure must be protected. Second cutest character, Piccolo. He holds his, <laughs> I his know. cellular phone oh, it's so like cute. a little cretin. I love it. Yeah, this is mm-hmm. definitely, you know, I know this is advertised as like the Gohan movie kind of. This is definitely the Piccolo movie. This is the, I, this this is the Piccolo movie. I, I think Toriyama said that he wrote this with Piccolo like, okay. as just the character. And oh, then okay. then people were like, put Gohan in it. And makes like, sense, okay. I guess. That makes sense. There's a lot of stuff in perspective, actually. He got, like, a lot of, like, I mean, he's always had character development, but he got, like, a special small tidbits of character development mm-hmm. of just, like, little insights into his life. He has and, a like, house. He's he very, has a house. He's he, so likable, right? He has a bunch of plushies. He's the best. Yeah. How do you dislike Piccolo? Especially after this movie. He mm-hmm. technically got two transformations. Yeah. One of them, he yeah. kind of turns, like, like goldenish, and then the other one... Mustard wee, yellow wee, and then... Wee, 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 wee. Chad <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, Yeah, so, I mean, how do we want to do this? Do we want to go through just, like, the general plot, like, break through there? Yeah. Or do we want to talk about each character? Whatever. What do you think, Brian? I think we should do general plot. Okay. Pro- plot. And we'll tackle and then, characters yeah. as we go. Yeah. And okay. then maybe a section where each of us, like, kind of gives yeah. our final thoughts uh-huh. sure we did that on uh i think we did that with spider-man too yeah, we, we just did. went through the plot so yeah yeah let's do that okay uh-huh. so the movie starts so i will say before yeah. before we begin i was wondering how this movie was gonna be like broken down because like in um the broly movie there was like three parts of the movie there yeah. was the bardock shit and then snow and then gogeta right right <laughs> so i was like mm-hmm. what's gonna be the bardock of this and it was red ribbon we got yeah. a lot of red ribbon shit. Yeah, we yeah. We did. So, yeah, it's because we start off with... We, first off, we start off with a really well-animated, like, Dragon Ball recap. The Red Ribbon Army uh-huh. recap. And then mm. after that, uh, which I immediately went over to Blake and I was like, why wasn't this movie animated like this? Yeah. It yeah. was beautiful. Oh, it was, really it was, it was gorgeous. It was so yeah. good. It was really well not done. Not that... Uh, not, uh, I might as well get this out of the way to begin with. This movie wasn't bad looking. No. Um, it looked a lot it, better than I thought it was It pleasantly surprised me. Yeah. It, um, as I was saying to Blake earlier, it almost sells me on the 3D anime art style. I agree. Almost. almost I don't agree. get crazy, though. I know. Yeah. Don't get crazy. It definitely is the best 3D animation I've seen in anime. Mm, yeah, right? for sure. sure. Um, very fluid. It never distracted me, like the look. Um, Sometimes it did. Yeah. Did Sometimes it. it looked it looked a little like 
little meh. Hmm. Remember the yeah, CG in Duel Masters? Is that what you're trying to? Yeah. Damn. That's yeah. a burn. That's what I think of when I think of anime CG Duel Masters. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, but anyway, um, so we start off with the, that little recap, and then we go into what the Red Ribbon Army is doing, which uh, is pretty cool. Yeah. Like you know, they start a f- uh, pharmaceutical front. They big didn't even far- big pharma. Didn't baby. Even, <laughs> they didn't even try to hide like who they were. Like, it was like the same, the same logo. logo. Yeah, like, same font. Just that's, like if, that's like if the same third. It's like if the third Reich like did change like their symbol, but like they put a flower behind it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. They just went <laughs> like you know so great um we got to see our villain uh magenta magenta, magenta yeah. that was it because commander red's like right. grandson or something yeah. yeah um which was cool we got confirm majin 21 in canon now well what i, I don't think it's majin 21 i would oh, sorry android it's whatever 21 her, whatever, whatever her, name her name is which is awesome yeah from fighters mm-hmm. uh she's i, I thought oh. that was sick she was in the family tree yes that's right that's right dead that's right. confirmed Rose White. yeah yeah uh oh wow. i don't know unknown confirmed. yeah um did we ever get confirmation in the show that 16 was jero's son um, he is based no, off no, 16's of, based off of his son, of okay. his son who like died in war or something that was confirmed so that was right? another little it, easter egg it was, it was for all you viewers show. at home it was mm. like some passing comment by Toriyama or written in some book yeah, or some something book. okay cool uh, so, so this is like official non-spoken confirmation it existed on the wiki Oh yes, the most uh, knowledgeable <laughs> and the most, yeah. reliable the source. Bible. <laughs> um, so we got uh, Carmine. Was his name? Yeah. Uh, How could you forget his name? He was really with the funny. pompadour. Yeah, because mm-hmm. he, he made little like YouTube videos, uh-huh. uh, like like produced by Carmine. Like I thought that was he was funny. Yeah. I liked him. Uh, and they talked about um, I already forgot the stupid twerp's name. Uh, Doctor Hido. 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 Doctor Hido, who is Jero's grandson. Yeah. And is mm-hmm. apparently smarter than him and can make better androids. And they're like, let's How use them. How convenient! Em. And he loves Oreos. Mm. You and fucking does love, love them. They're called shits. creams cookies. We can't use the. <laughs> and he got billions of them. Yeah. Billions. <laughs> billions. He got paid Oreos. in Oreos. <laughs> His Double. car had an endless supply. I know. Car. I know. You know the... yeah. Can we get that car? Dude, I want an endless supply of magenta inspired yeah. oreos um so they get they get uh they pick him up after he um gets out of jail um and you do. leaves a freaking grenade and no one bats an eye well hey you know they're they were making fun they, of they're like dumbass <laughs> i guess you're right so like fuck those guys <laughs> the best, yeah, fuck, the best kill part them. of the movie see you later dumbass <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just chucks a grenade in there. you can tell they just like brought in people in the studio and uh-huh. just yell stuff like, i think you say off the dumbass. streets yeah yeah <laughs> No, they they got the janitor, mm-hmm. that, that crunchy roll. <laughs> um, so uh, enlist. He's like, oh hey, Bulma of Capsule Corp has these aliens, and and I like this part. He, um, Magenta convinces uh, Hito, uh-huh. Fajito, whatever that <laughs> um, that Bulma's and those and you know our heroes are the bad guys because yeah. they're like these it's like a conspiracy thing uh-huh. right um which i thought was pretty interesting but it sounded like magenta like also like really thought that that they're like oh you think so all powerful or something uh, like, i don't know i think, I think he was hard selling it mm, yeah I maybe but, but i think there is like a degree Could, of he truth fooled me <laughs> i mean he's part of the red ribbon army and they but had, they also thought yeah. they still thought like satan was strong so there's some. I feel like that was mm, a tongue true. in cheek the whole time. I think they he know. On, I think he they was re- on the machine. Yeah, I think they really believed Satan was strong, but they didn't know how strong. Yeah, uh, I think they were really under the impression that he was strong. Yeah, okay. the, the whole world is still. You know, well, I mean, he is a world he, champion. He is the world yeah, champion. He, the world he champion. did beat Majin Buu. Go, go. Though, um, uh, they wished no one knew of Majin Buu, and then Magenta was like, "Hey, look, Majin Buu." So that is true. One day my boy is gonna be back. One day he's gonna wake up from that nap, get buff again, become fit boo once Listen, more. All yeah, you're man. getting it's gonna is happen. that fight with him and one of those universe dogs. It's has yeah. pretty lit. Hey, Borgamo's That's back. all you got. I want my boy <laughs> justice for boo. He needs um, to come hashtag back. Hashtag justice for boo. <laughs> so um yeah, so the Hito's like, Okay, yeah, I'll join you and uh only if, you know, we use it for good and, and you know, all these androids uh-huh. to for peace and love and all that, because he likes superheroes for some reason. Yeah, yeah. Um, my hero academia. Yeah, he's I like, should say I really I'll make like Deku. 
they have this like animation of like Balma looking evil and with like the oh. androids behind her and like and Yamcha and Shao- Tien. Yeah. Shao- Shao- yeah. Shao- yeah. <laughs> Dude, when I saw Shao Tzu in the center of the frame of that, I was like, "Yo, the they know, villain. they know." Um, so mm-hmm. you know, then you know, time skip happens, da da da, and we have Piccolo training Pan. Uh, Cute super adorable very good very good uh she's... it was it was the axel and Kyrie of our hearts you know way better yeah i agree but you didn't get to see them train <laughs> i know <laughs> hey we're training um it was really uh cute pan's awesome um already loving the direction where she's going mm. uh she's three years old kicking mm-hmm. ass and uh piccolo practically as tall as curlin now <laughs> yep maybe taller yeah. Uh, and then and then she goes home. She does the Arale run. Oh, I was about to say, oh, yeah. she did the Arale she, run. She did the Arale oh, run. I'll, I'll, good callback. Yeah. That was a good callback to, to that. Who's Arale? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, talking to me? She's over there. <laughs> <laughs> she was another creation of Toriyama's. Oh, okay. It was like a, in a gag comic kind oh, okay, of thing. Okay. She was actually in an episode of Super as like a filler episode. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then okay. there's some Dragon Ball episodes with her in it. Yeah. Oh. Um, hmm. But anyway. Um, Get educated, Brian. <laughs> I'll have so, to read the wiki later. <laughs> so, Consult my notes. We get our one... Uh, so, yeah, so Piccolo gets a call on his cell phone that has a cat, like, case. Very cute. Oh, the um, cutest. It, was, it, was a, it had a tie. It had a green tie. It was It was, it was his colors. It was... Yeah, that's all right. Oh, okay. Um, it was, um, it was purple. purple and oh, green. I didn't, yeah, I didn't really yeah. notice mm-hmm. that. That's oh, cute. Oh, good pull. Um, it was Videl. You know, she we had got screen her. time. She had some screen time. <laughs> Asking well, her to pick not up. Not even a minute. It's gonna leave. <laughs> <laughs> um, but we get her, and uh, she's like, "Yo, pick up my daughter, bitch!" And people's like, "I am a bitch." Uh, and true story. This sounds like he so. does this a lot. Yeah, Actually, yeah. It, so it, it, it was confirmed does that he does. Yeah. This a lot. yeah, yeah. He's definitely you know like Pan. He's the third parent, right? So just like how Piccolo was Gohan's daddy. He's now sure pants. that's the the parallel yeah. they're pulling here, and, it, and it, but it's way healthier. I mean, he's on yeah. a first name basis with Pan's teacher, Janet. So. Yeah. yeah, that was awesome. Thanks, Janet. <laughs> yeah. um, oh, hey, Piccolo. Hey, what's up, Janet? <laughs> what's up, babe? <laughs> What'd you do it after? <laughs> <laughs> Do you notice she was in the beginning? Yeah, yeah she, she was, was the, the driver. Car. She was yeah, the yeah, NPC yeah. driving yeah. the car. Um. So, uh, before he picks her, has to pick her up. He gets attacked by. Gamma two. <laughs> we get our our, our antagonist uh, at the beginning there, and they have a little fight. Um, it was, what do you guys think of that fight? Piccolo got chumped. He did get chumped. He did get well, chumped. Well, for a purpose. Yeah, it wasn't like a complete a good chump. No, I I think like they you know had it out. I think actually no, I think he would have lost. But that's beside the point. <laughs> it was I mean, fine. G- Gamma was always stronger, right? Yeah. So yeah. He held his own pretty well, but he had his own uh, uh, sound effects. And uh, oh, his, his visual um, gags, his visual, yeah, yeah. He's like, Why can't I see your sound effects? <laughs> yeah. uh, but with, which they did explain, yeah, he yeah. has like a hologram, which they never go into again, no. which is kind of disappointing. Yeah. But like, he has the cool, like, kapow, but it's yeah. actually real. It's these Dukun. holograms in play, <laughs> yeah. Duk- I thought it said Dokkan, that's what I thought too. Dude, I was like, yeah. Oh no, that's over. what that means, like, it's like yeah. blast or whatever, or um, explosion. But Piccolo ends up, quote unquote, losing, kind of fakes his own death thing, and he follows Gamma Two to um, the Red Ribbon Army secret base, which looks cool, right? Um, mm. It was basically Wakanda. <laughs> yeah, but it was Wakanda like. No, because like it had the force field yeah, that the like camouflage, yep. and then when you go in, Wakanda's it's the, the only place that's ever done that. Except, yeah, <laughs> yeah it's the Red Ribbon Wakanda. <laughs> Except forever. it had like, like. A front entrance. I just said the name. Yeah, like it wasn't even the pharmaceutical. It was red ribbon. I'm like what the what the hell's the point of the stealth thing? It seemed like the, uh, it seemed like the workers were like, "There's great morale there." Yeah, I wonder yeah. like what What's benefits up, they got. Yeah. How you doing, Tony? Yeah, dude, they really <laughs> they were, were like, so happy. What's up, brother? Piccolo was squatting, Slav squatting, talking to Bulma. The guy was just like, hey. <laughs> "Yeah, <laughs> oh, like, oh, oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah." yeah. <laughs> um, I will say this movie was funny. Yeah. Oh, uh, a lot I, of jokes. I, I, I smiled many see. times. A lot of good jokes. Yeah. Mm. Except um, uh, go tanks, but we'll get to that. Oh. <laughs> uh, so, um, Piccolo discovers, you know, Gamma 1 and Gamma 2 and the whole plot. And uh, we get the name drop of Cell Max. <laughs> so, uh, I was aware. Me too. Of Cell Max. Me too. Mm-hmm. And what he looked like. Me too. 
yeah well i wasn't and yeah. i called it <laughs> yep, i called did. it you from did. the start i said he's coming back baby and guess what are he you was saying back. the movie with the red ribbon army has sell i believe it? you i am <laughs> um and everyone doubted me even before the spoilers <laughs> it wasn't raditz thank god <laughs> thank kami uh he's not uh, kami anymore Stop calling me that. <laughs> Fuck. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Piccolo's like, oh shit, I better get Piccolo, or I better get Goku. <laughs> Is this guy and... talking to himself? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I better get Goku and Vegeta up in here. Um, meanwhile, Goku and Vegeta are off on Whis's planet, or Beerus's, you know, place. Uh-huh. Uh, you know, just general training with Broly. Broly? Yeah, Broly. There. My boy, Broccoli. Uh, Broly's like, they're like, Broly, why don't you just fucking settle down? You mm. keep like losing your shit. And yeah, you he better take your pills. Before you fight. He was doing his whole like yeah. thing. Yeah. And Goku was like, chill the fuck out, bro. Dude, dude, <laughs> don't make me fuse with that boy over there and kick your ass again. Stop breaking my back. <laughs> yes, I mean. <laughs> um, uh, and then, so we got uh, Le- Lemon. Yeah, Lemo. He, he, he's back. <laughs> he's back. And then we get. What's your name? Chilai. Yeah. Uh weird flex happened in this movie where Beerus is like, the hell are you doing it? Hello. <laughs> and uh, apparently uh Beerus has a type. Yeah. And he's that's what, we, that's what we said. <laughs> yeah. And he just and he wants to bang Chilai. To oblivion. But to, he wants to hide don't, don't, her womb. Don't tell Broly. <laughs> yeah, really. I don't know the moment he figures out. Pyramid? <laughs> <laughs> Think about it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, <laughs> what, did, what, did, what did you guys really think of the the that part of like weird like Chilai Beerus being into Chilai? Um, I heard about that, so I knew that. Oh, you did? I yeah. had no idea. Okay. Well, then what do you think about it? Um, You've had time to think about yeah, it. You, you it's an interesting gag. Yeah, I mean, it's like a common anime gag, right? Yeah. Like, I think it's appropriately Dragon Ball. Yeah, I didn't dislike mm, the it. The cat god and the green bitch. Just mm. no, just like the weirdness <laughs> of it, like the out of nowhere, like what? Um, because yeah, he's he's yeah. still like not like that. That's what until, I meant by like, the because uh, um in Battle true. of Gods, uh, Balma tried to put the moves on him. Yeah, and he was like, nah. Guess he likes your green. Oh no, I'm thinking of no. She did that to Zam- uh, Zamasu. Did she? Maybe she also did that to Beerus. I wouldn't be surprised if yeah. she tried with Beerus. Probably did. Um, That's what I meant by the typical anime thing. Two disparate kinds of characters, like uh, yeah. one of them being like, "Hey, a wooga, a wooga." Yeah, she's yeah. clearly not interested. Right? And she's like, like, kind of she's trying to rob him. But what's what I liked about it is he doesn't like like force himself on. Yeah, her, right? I was it's worried like that was me too. I was, was actually was very that polite. Way. Yeah, I was yeah. really worried he would pull like the god of destruction card on her and be like you know yeah you do something you I, know i was initially very uncomfortable i was like oh no but that but then it was just like your space yeah yeah but then it was just like uh, i'll get the ice cream and he's like i'll get it too let's he was go just, he was flirting i was yeah. like oh. he was he was really nice in this movie he's yeah, just like hey why don't you do the dishes later and like come relax with us and he's like, just, he's, trying, yeah. he's trying oh, to get an in baby this guy horny horny <laughs> <laughs> i like um i like the, the fact that I think Broly, Chila, you know, I think that group should yeah. stay on that planet. It keeps them a bit more relevant in and the story. And not on uh, Spider-Land? Yeah, not on... Spider-Land. Yeah, stupid. We're in a cabin in a cave in uh-huh. the middle of freaking nowhere. Yeah. Bah. <laughs> Rest in peace. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> I wear so. him on my hip. Oonga boonga. <laughs> uh, so, you know, uh, that scene was fine. And then we did like a brief little fight between Vegeta and Goku, uh, which was pointless. Uh-huh. But pointless it was pointless come po- on two notes from this this overall pointless. scene yep um I, how'd, how'd you guys enjoy johnny young bosh for his four lines yeah pretty good his first anime appearance yeah he, he, was, he was him in fighters right and stuff uh, he sounds great yeah. i mean yeah he gets the job he was like bonkai bonkai <laughs> <laughs> he's a cool Kakarot. power ranger um second point and yeah Vegeta rocking the Majin Buu saga outfit. Oh, mm. yeah. Vegeta looked great. Yeah. Um, I love it. Did Goku look a little weird in this movie? When he was just like, do, he was style. doing some like, well, I think, listen, we just saw him in Fortnite, and that was just so beautifully like animated. Fortnite? Fortnite. Yeah, especially, <laughs> especially when he hit the gritty. <laughs> um, yeah, um, it looked a little weird. I, yeah, I don't know. Um, 
I thought the, the can't um, all be winners. And this point goes for the whole movie. I think the melee fight choreography was pretty good in this yeah. movie. That's some uh, good wrestling moves in there. Oh yeah, yeah. Was yeah, it the brain blaster that happened? Brain blast. Brain blast. <laughs> we'll get to that. <laughs> um, but anyway, so that's pretty much the last time we really see them. Yeah. Uh, in any significant value, they, they're written off the movie now. Mm-hmm. You know, they took care of that. Mm-hmm. Balmas was trying to get them. Yeah, Balmas trying to contact, yeah, yeah. but the, an ice cream bucket was thrown over yeah. the Lisa staff. I so. hate when that. And she happens. wanted a fatter ass. Mm-hmm. So Piccolo <laughs> goes to. <laughs> Kami, or uh, yeah, he does the Kami's look. There was also a scene where he sees Gohan, and he's like, "Dude, you gotta like get your shit together." Mm-hmm. And Gohan's like, "Ants, Super Saiyan ants, Super Saiyan ants." So here's the question: If you look on his desk, he's got two pictures. One, the marriage picture, which we saw in Super, and then the other one was mm. that iconic photo of Goku and Gohan as a yeah. kid. Mm. Took that photo. Who took it? Yeah, because uh, yeah, we saw that happen in the show. Who took it? Yajirobe. Did someone have it on VLC player and hit screenshot or something? Send Corrin. it to Gohan? Corrin. Maybe it was Corrin. Uh, in his was, eyes. You know. Maybe it was Dende. Dende can do crazy stuff. Yeah, uh, he, he is he tall now. Time. He is tall now. <laughs> he can <could> do anything. <laughs> uh, so Piccolo goes to uh, Corrin's lookout, gets two sensu beans. Don't know why Corrin in peacetime didn't have like a shit ton of sensu beans. Is he Maybe just because slacking? it's peacetime. Maybe, Maybe they're like... in a drought. I don't know. People, we, we've yeah, never true. seen how like they're made it's or true. like. But where's he growing? Like, climate you... change. Could climate. be affecting. <laughs> yeah. Oh, climate <laughs> change has really made this difficult. <laughs> yeah, Man, he keeps eating like, them. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> Corrin. Oh, no. He's just really political. Like, no, he's Corrin. just really bad with it. Corrin, you can't say these. Things. <laughs> uh, guys... What are they teaching your kids in school? No, Corin, <laughs> please. Uh, anyway, um, did you guys like um, Yajirobe for his zero lines of dialogue? Yeah, he ate. Yeah, he's still repenting from getting eviscerated in the future of Trunks arc. So. Yeah, 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 he really hit him hard. Yeah, um, he do- uh, Piccolo goes to Dende. Yeah, and just, who's tall now? So, who's tall now? Mm-hmm. So, le- point of reference. Um, when we first met Dende, he was short. In Majin Buu Saga, he was tall. Mm. In Super, he's short. And now in this movie, he's tall. So, I think he's using his growing technique. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're right. Really? <laughs> he's just. So. Where was Popo, by the way? Yeah, where was Popo? They probably wanted to avoid hyperbolic it. time chamber. Yeah, maybe that he's man training. is training. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's, he's getting ready. I think they something. just wanted to avoid a race thing. <laughs> what? I don't. I mean, he was people, in the show. Because whenever Popo's around, people like you know. Because he's. I think people would have popped. Would for they Popo. do blue Popo? No. What? Oh. I think people would have popped for Popo. Listen, Everyone loves. Popo. Listen, they. Yeah, showed... I love Popo. I'm yeah. not denying it. Listen, they showed Commander Red while he sure, is. That's true. You know, I mean, uh, Commander. Is it black? no Officer Black? I'm sorry. Officer Black. Staff Officer Black. Yeah. Officer Black. Well, they showed him get his ass whomped. Yeah. 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 But he was there. Yeah. Mr. Popo's you know, great. Everyone loves Mr. Popo. He's I the strongest character. They changed him to blue. Listen, I, I almost saying. <laughs> All I'm saying is they changed. So the he was in the hyperbolic time chamber, dying his skin. Yeah, Blue? yeah. He's like, oh, call me. <laughs> uh, uh, so uh, they upgrade the dragon by pouring spit on it. Or yeah, something. Just, they spit roasted the dragon. <laughs> Speak your wish. Uh, so they upgrade the dragon, uh, and they use the dragon balls that Bulma has been collecting for cosmetic surgery uh-huh. to unlock. A uh, good callback to unlock Piccolo's mm-hmm. potential the same way that Guru did to Krillin and Gohan. I don't know if they used the Kai footage of uh, Guru unlocking Krillin's no, potential. That, that was, was all like original. Like, uh, that looked really... worse than the original. What? I thought it looked decent. I mean, uh... it wasn't a one-for-one one shot. It was like a zoomed-out version. Well, so I, I think the, the, the quote-unquote quality. cinematography of it was worse, um, but I thought the quality was pretty good. Yeah, mm, All, right. Like, like the angles. This movie was, had was a basic. lot of like, like either direct callbacks with like newly made footage, right, or anim- animation of it. it. Like we saw that cool footage of Trunks killing Frieza. Yeah, it was like yeah. a fan cam. Frieza. Yeah, it was really cool though. I of, like loved just how that. fast it actually went down. Yeah, so without like the anime pauses. Or That's rushing, a good point. That it was, was like from a normal person watching it. It was like Frieza did his attack. He dodged it. Did his burning attack? Frieza jumped in the air, cut him up, and blasted him all like, within like three seconds. It was <laughs> awesome. It was actually really tight. That was a good pull. Uh-huh. Um, so, uh, 
yeah, so Piccolo gets his potential, whatever, and then he makes this ploy. He goes back to the Red Ribbon Army on in disguise, and he's just like, all right, I really want to make, I want to get Gohan to be serious mm-hmm. about his training. So um, he helps kidnap Pan in a, a funny scene. <laughs> uh, and uh, just another example of Pan being, like, super cute. Yeah. She's all like, oh, no, like... I liked how they didn't make her dumb. No. Right? Yeah. They didn't make her like a stupid kid. Mm-hmm. She was just like, okay, sure. Like she's, she doesn't feel like she's in any like any danger at all. Yeah. You know, mostly because she could kick the shit out of anyone there. Uh-huh. Um, but uh they kidnap Pan, bring her back, and then uh we finally get like a little bit of Gohan freaking out when Piccolo and a dude comes back. He's like, We got your daughter. And he like collapses <laughs> half of his house. Yep. So he's like, "We got on There better not be a scratch on that bitch. <laughs> I was like, "We getting, we getting the boy back." Yeah, the um, beginning of the end. That was sick. I love that. Mm. You know, um, that's why I went to see this movie. Yeah. My boy, my boy. See my boy flip shit. Mm-hmm. Um, so they go back to the Red Ribbon Army with Gohan. Gohan just flips out and uh, starts a fight. Gets intercepted, and we get the Gamma 1, Gamma 2 fight with Piccolo, Gohan, um, mm-hmm. over there. Uh, obviously, trouble. I'm skipping details. It's yeah, fine. Yeah. Uh, they, they start fighting, and then we get the reveals of some new stuff. We mm. get uh, Piccolo's new form. Chad Piccolo, is that oh. right? Well, first, he turned, I think, he turned into Ultimate Piccolo first. Yeah. Which was yeah, just, the, just like, yellow hue, yellow, yellow hue. Which does nothing. Yeah. It, just, it, it allowed him not to die. He gave him a slightly thicker neck and, like, some, like, uh, temple dimples. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, um, yeah. But he gets jobbed. <laughs> by... Yeah, it didn't. It didn't do much. Yeah. Uh, for his uh fight yeah. against Gamma. Yeah. But then he gets hit like downward into like this pit, mm-hmm. and then for him, like the world tree Yggdrasil <laughs> forms yeah. on him, and he just. Like, that's uh, sp- apparently that's like the Namekian symbol. I guess so, which is cool. Yeah. Um, and we'll just roll with it. But we get like the Shenron. Like uh, that was oh, I will go back for a second. The, when he summoned Shenron uh-huh. to make the wish. Oh, it looked awesome. It was so yeah. cool. Yeah, it was very cool. I though. thought that, like... It was, like, pitch black. Exactly. Yeah. They uh-huh. really use that darkness so well. Yeah. And I love Shenron. Like, whenever Shenron shows up, I think he's... It's so cool. Uh, Such a bro. Um, yeah. Like oh, hey, you like, people oh, are so yeah. cute. <laughs> no, I think he was talking to Balma. No, he was about to say, speak your wish and... Oh, hey, Piccolo. No, he said, oh, it's you. But to Balma. No, he said because it to Piccolo. Always... No, he said it to Piccolo. How do you, they were standing right he next to each other? He said the name Piccolo. I'll get back to you on that. Uh, okay, you get back to me. Right. Check the wiki. That was. I'm gonna edit it tonight. Right. <laughs> it was a that was a sick scene. Uh, I just love seeing the Dragon Balls actually like disperse. Yeah, it looks it's so cool. It's always good. Um. Anyway, so back. So we get Chad Piccolo. Yeah. Uh. Full. Uh. What do you guys, What do you guys think of Chad Piccolo? I love it. Awesome. I think it's great. He. It, it's been a long time coming for my boy. It's. It's a really cool transformation because it's like diff. It's different, um, and it's really particular to like him. Yeah, right? it's not like God Key or Blue. Mm-hmm. Or it's not like UI. something I think any Namekian can do. I think it's uniquely Piccolo's. Yeah, it's weird. It's like this, it's like all like the energy he's gotten over the years. Yeah, I do wish there was like. Well, I'll go into it later, but um, he is really cool. He's thick. Yeah, with three C's. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh, and he and he just one shots. Damn it too. Yep. Mm-hmm. Very satisfying. Very hype. Mm-hmm. Um Gohan is ultimate Gohan at this point. Uh the the fight between Gamma One and Gohan kind of stops because Pan breaks out and Carmine's like, I'm gonna blow this kid's brains out. <laughs> yeah, uh, you know, yeah. can't do it. <laughs> yeah. Uh and uh Gamma One's like, yo, don't shoot that kid. And, and, and then she Pan, yeah. takes him out and he dies in Napa pose yeah snaps his uh-huh. neck and like rips his head off and drinks his blood yeah, that was awesome that's my fan <laughs> <laughs> there's my girl um magenta I was gonna call him margarita for some yeah. reason that's, <laughs> Mag- a, that's one of the angels is that oh you're right the pigtail they're right you're right you're right mm-hmm. uh magenta is just like oh shit everything's <laughs> going wrong and he goes down to the basement and he's like I'm gonna activate and sell mats uh boop, boop, boop. Cell Max and IMAX. Hito. Ooh. Conspiracy. Hito, mm. Hito tries to like stop him and he's like, ha he's a little too confident. Uh, so he ends up killing uh, Magenta, but in his last throw. You're skipping a very important part of that. So uh, Magenta guns down. Oh, oh no. Yeah. <laughs> You're missing an important point before that. 
Magenta turns into the senator from uh, Metal Gear Solid Revengeance. Oh my god, you're so right. <laughs> oh, this was before body. he shot him. No, that, no, I meant that was after he shot him. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. he shoots him, uh-huh. double taps him. Yeah, in a really funny scene where he just like... <laughs> <laughs> he just shoots his body a couple times, but we heard at the very beginning of the movie, uh, Hito, uh, Hito has skin that can repel mm-hmm. blunt force. He's got boo skin. It was, a, yeah. it was a joke that kind of kept reoccurring and... I don't know. He said it the exact same way a lot, but anyway. Yeah, um... And he even says, he's just like, oh, yeah, you told me that, so that's on me. Yeah, I'm yeah. Oops. Yeah. Uh, but he ends up activating Cell Matt. Uh, Cell Matt is like, rah, and, you know, starts a big fight. So uh, let's, cr- talk, let's talk about Cell Max real quick. You want to talk about Design Cell Max now? Wise. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm. What'd you th- All right, so basically he's a semi-perfect Cell. Right. With Shin Godzilla. Red. Um, he's got like a like a malice for a ball. I mean, a tail. tail. Um, you mean yeah. a a malice, a mace. You mean mace. A mace. There we go. It's very malefic. Like, like the you know the swing flail. Thing. You know. I know. <laughs> you know? Uh-huh. <laughs> um. Yeah. What do you guys think of his design? I thought it was scary. I thought it was pretty good. It was all right. Mm. Uh, he does. I didn't like his feet. They look like weird boots. He has his boots in second form. Actually, and I think they've no, they look like China has them too. They looked like like Nikes. Like no, Tim's. they look. Yeah, they look, got Tim's on. They look like work boots. Yeah, like Tim's work boots or something. <laughs> the steel toe. Yeah, um, yeah. He does a cool Shin Godzilla thing where it's like, oh yeah, if, with a... if you if you watch the Shin Godzilla like beam thing, it is like exactly mm. that. Like yep. from yeah. the tail and everything. Yeah. Like it's just a full rip off that, which is fine. I think I leaned over and said as much too during. I was like, oh, it's mm-hmm. Godzilla now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. I didn't really like it. You don't like the ta- the tail was cool, but mm-hmm. um, I I got things. Uh huh. It was serviceable. I mean, it wasn't I, yeah. the coolest design. I liked the eyes. I think um, when you have big monsters like that, I think you get the worst fights. Yeah, personally. Yeah, because mm-hmm. um, you got to work around. Yep. The bigness. At least you got yeah. like when because at one point so during this fight, uh, eighteen Krillin. Uh, Goten Trunks yeah. uh, show up to help, uh, which is its oh yeah, Bulma thing. drops them off. Yeah, Bulma yeah. drops. I got the world's mightiest team. Yeah, where's Tien and Yamcha and all them? <laughs> where's Mister Satan? <laughs> oh boy, watching Attack on Titan. <laughs> <laughs> um, Piccolo does his giant form thing. Which is uh, pretty cool. I know this is later, but yeah, I just Krillin was like, him. get big. Yeah, I like how Krillin was around. like, dude, can you just like do that thing you did before? And he's like, oh yeah, oh, yeah. we're out about that one. Um, but anyway, uh, Gamma Two sacrifices himself. He does nothing. So, <laughs> so he tries to. So the whole sacrifice thing. So he yeah. has a big old weakness on his head. Yeah. A little like shiny black part on cell, uh-huh. like between the two little. Here's a nucleus. Things. Yeah, in my <laughs> nucleus. That's the weak point. And they're like, if you destroy this, like he'll pretty much blow up self destruct yeah. mode, like he did way back when. Um, there was and, somebody uh, in the theater when the, it was like his head. Someone said, "Here's a nucleus." Yeah, I heard, yeah. Yeah, I heard that. <laughs> so funny. I thought that was you. <laughs> <laughs> that was someone else. Um. So um. So they're aiming for I, I will say that moment where Gamma Two he like goes into orbit and comes down. Yeah, gorgeous. Yeah, that was, awesome. yeah, that was really so cool. beautiful really cool. looking. Uh-huh. Beautiful, really, looking. really cool. Um, but it fails. Uh, it weakens his head, but it, it fails in Ultimately its ultimate. Yeah. Before um, we continue, I think we're skipping a very major plot point. Goten and Trump. Yeah, I know yeah. We, we briefly um, mentioned. Let's talk, let's talk about them. Um, so they're they're grown up a little bit, and they explain it. Yeah, and they do explain it, where uh, Gohan states, like, oh, you know, one day we're really small, and then suddenly we're pretty big. We just have a sudden growth spurt. Yep. Stay like in children, stay small for pretty while, and then suddenly we just like, oh, yeah. have a big old growth spurt. Which I, I mean, that did, ha- was the that case. did happen to Goku. That, it, it, I don't did. have any problem with it, because yeah. I, I legit thought that was actually how it worked anyway. Uh-huh. I mean, they also have like bits where like pure Saiyan's hair never changes either, so yeah. like weird, quirky things. Mm-hmm. I also can't believe it's like, you know, it isn't like a they wake up like that, right? Yeah. It happens like <laughs> over like a shit. year. <laughs> <laughs> hey, mom. <laughs> um. Uh, they look great. Uh, I like their general attitudes too. Yeah. Uh, like Trunt seems definitely more like the teen, like the I'm gonna hang out, like uh-huh. hands in his pockets, yeah, like I'm, yeah. he's maturing, yeah. life preserver vest. Yeah. I he hate looked, those. I, I, yeah, <laughs> take that back. Everything <laughs> yeah. about Trunks is perfect. 
I hate his blue I'll hair. destroy the recording hate his blue right hair. now. <laughs> no, please. No. <laughs> um, the uh, and then Goten. Um, we don't get a lot of either of them, which is kind of a shame. But uh, Goten seems less goofy, but still has like that jovial. What? What's on? Boyish. In that fan cam footage, Trunks had purple hair. The future Trunks. Uh huh. I didn't. Yeah. I didn't know. Wouldn't he have purple well, hair? In Super, they they try to Don't start this. With this that, is like, a different conversation. Wait, he dyes his hair. It's the same kind. He dyes his hair later. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Just deal with it. Um, we got into a big argument the, about this. And they did the flashback with future Trunks, <laughs> uh, future Gohan dying, and he had the blue hair. Okay. Yeah, wait a minute. This this Trunks had blue this hair. This is not the episode. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold on. No, question, question. No. Wait, he had blue hair in this movie, right? The This Trunks. But Gotenks had the purple. Didn't make he? up your mind. Yeah, he had the purple. He did. Yeah. Did he? Yeah, the black. I thought it was, the, just, no, the thought it was just black. No, no, he had the purple. Huh. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh wow. Think okay. About anyway. That. Anyway. Um. So. Uh, hmm. Yeah. So they have the the perfect self fight. Whatever. Perfect. Sorry. Self. I. You know. Perfect projecting. <laughs> well, um, they all uh, go ten trunks fused and they fucked it up. Yeah, they fucked it up. They got fat. I, I really like how uh, Piccolo reacted because, like, you know, he's the one that taught him. He's yeah, like, he was idiots. mad. He was mad. <laughs> I like how he noticed first, and it was like, oh boy, he was molding. Uh-huh. I'd be molding too. Um, we got some ass shots. A lot of ass tanks. shots. Yeah, a lot of, more of than I was hoping. Of the, of many. People. There were a lot of ass shots in this. There was movie. there was yeah. a couple Chila, crotch shots. Chilai. too. Yeah, we got a very long crotch shot of Hito. In yep. the yeah, in the beginning. Yeah, yeah. very long, oh uncomfortably God. long. <laughs> yeah, I'll be uh, uh, ass shot of Bulma. That was like the first shot of her. It was. It, it was, was an ass like, shot. It was like, an, it was like a side ass shot too. It was weird. I mean, yeah. Chile's wearing the spandex, so mm-hmm. any shot with her they from like, behind his they ass like, shot. You know that they were like, well, I put a little more shading on that <laughs> ass crack. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, <laughs> thanks. Ooga, ooga. <laughs> um, didn't get any 18 ass shots though. She was, why was she here? Oh, well, whatever. Anyway. Um, Cause Cell Max. I guess. <laughs> Cause Curlin. Yeah. Looks like a toddler now. Don't get me started. He really does. They I, really didn't um, fix that about him. You win some, you lose some. Right? So That's mad true. About that. Uh so uh Piccolo goes giant, they fight more. Uh Piccolo Big old kaiju s- fight. sacrifices himself, quote unquote. He gets his ass beat. He gets his ass beat. He gets his ass beat. Uh, and uh, it sparks Gohan's new transformation, sicko mode. <laughs> um, it's, it's Beast Gohan. Yeah, or beast, Final Gohan. Beast mode Gohan. Whatever it'll be officially translated to. Uh-huh. Um, what did you guys think of that um, so transformation? Is, I've also seen. I didn't I haven't seen. The, I didn't see the transformation. Same. By seeing the form. Yeah, I saw like just like a still of his form, which uh-huh. I didn't see his eyes though. Which yeah, uh, it was like red. Yeah. What What do you guys think? Sicko mode. <laughs> As someone who has had not seen either. Yeah, yeah. Because I was purely unspoiled, like pure, a good boy. Pure heart. Yeah, uh-huh. Pure of heart, pure of mind. I thought it was incredible. That was very cool. It, it was really uh also great animation on that yeah. part. Yes. Awesome looking. It is so cool. Uh-huh. Um I will say this animation style lent really well to like energy effects. Yeah, like auras um, and stuff. Mm. Which they didn't use a lot of energy attacks in this movie, uh-huh. um, at least toward, until towards like the endish, um, mm. which I was okay with, mm. which is fine. But uh, yeah, uh, Gohan looked really cool. Like when his eyes had like that red effect uh-huh. when he was while he was, was transforming, like circle, so yeah. cool. Yeah. Love that. It, yeah. it looked uh, stunning. Absolutely. It almost looked like mob psycho type animation. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, I agree. Um, what did you think of his Super Saiyan Four dude, voice. Uh, cool. I thought it was cool. Hey, yeah, was now cool. it's my turn. Uh, his hair is stupid, though. Can we? Can we? I don't know if we are, are we in agreement it's over so that. It's so anime, though. No, what it is. You know what it? I don't like the giant. Bang. I'm gonna tap a little bit into like when I when we get to our general. I'm gonna tap a little bit in my conversation. He looks that like hair, number four, go. All right. He huh? does look like number four for kids next door. Oh no. <laughs> no, he looks like they tried to do his Super Saiyan two giant hair look. That's exactly looked, what happened. And it looks stupid. I think it looks really dumb. Um, especially when he's like casually like turning the side and you see how big his hair is and it, yeah. and his one fringe is like half of his head. I know, yeah, I don't it, like that giant thing. goofy. Like, could yeah. you just like reduce that like 20% would yeah. look better? Anyway, sorry, nitpick. Um, he ends up, uh, Piccolo grabs on to Cell and- uh, He uses stretchy arms. He uses stretchy arms. Yeah, Mr. Stretch. And freaking, mm-hmm. he finishes him with the special beam cannon, <laughs> which looks I, I want to. I want to hear that in the um, 
the sub. Me too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably too. gonna be dope. Probably yeah. just Kyle Herbert again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they good. got him. <laughs> uh, that looks really cool. That was very good. Uh, and they they finish off Cell. It's pretty hype. Uh, Chan flies. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. was a thing. Because Krillin wasn't gonna save her. He's like, you gotta yeah. fly. Do it yourself. <laughs> good and luck. Then, and then the, the movie ends. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Damage is officially he got Thanos. Yeah. I think you're missing. Yeah, he like turned to dust. That was weird. Uh, I think your mi- movie ends. No, it doesn't. Nah, you're right. What we see at the very end uh-huh. after yeah. credits. Scene. Yeah, we see. Uh, oh, oh, get me, Mr. Expl- Gamma One join Capsule Corps. Oh yeah, that does explain. happen. That does explain. happen. Post credit scene. Vegeta <gasps> gets the W he does. over Goku. They've been sparring this whole time. The whole movie. It cuts back to them like <laughs> <laughs> slow punching each other, and Vegeta. Pulls the old, actually, it, was, it feels like it was kind of a throwback almost to the first world tournament or world martial arts tournament where Goku and Jackie oh, Chun oh, face oh. off. And one, he's not tall enough to like hit He him like, there. he stood up, he's like, I went, but he falls over before he could do it. And Jackie kind of gets it. It was like a slow mm-hmm. sort of end. Yeah, almost. yeah. But Vegeta pushes it's, it's very close. him down. Very, very close. Well, pushes a him tear down. to Broly's eyes. In Lemo. In Lemo. They were sitting there like, who? <laughs> I forget his name all the time. Lemo. So I call him a bunch of different names. Lemon. Guys. He doesn't and have the ass, okay? He's Vegeta. The chef. Vegeta was like, I finally beat Kakarot. Yeah, that was fun. That was cute. Where was his guy of destruction earring? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know when this movie takes place. It's, in it's after. It's it, after is it, all um, of it. Yeah. Is it after Granola? Yeah. Oh, really? Where was Gas? They don't even mention Dust these boy. things in the movies. Oh. Yeah, well, you know, so, they yeah. in It'd production like so long. There. Anyway, okay, okay. So that's the movie, the gist of it. Lots of little yeah. details missed, obviously. But uh-huh. uh, watch the movie. Yeah, do watch the movie. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. for sure. Let's let's get yeah, let's go right into it, gentlemen. Just, what do we think? Let's get the ugly out of the way. What didn't we like about this movie, Brian? You put me on the spot. Huh? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. I think if I had to choose one thing I didn't like about it was sometimes the animation was a little poopy, mm. a little dumpy, mm. didn't quite work. Um, lip syncing was a little off, which I don't know if they changed lip syncing for the English. Yeah. Because sometimes it did match up perfectly. Other times it like didn't. I mean, usually they just kind of like, they kinda, try like, their best. Yeah. But sometimes it matched up really well. Syncs. Yeah. I don't. With this animation style, I have no idea. Uh, yeah, I like they can do that Nowadays, with like, a 2D animation one yeah. easy, but I don't know. What Nowadays, with like you know the PS5 can do real time rendering, you know, shit. Like why was why wasn't this on the PS5? I guys? know, right? That's probably how they my does. South Korean six thousand dollar PS5 <laughs> guys. <laughs> but I would say my biggest problem: a lot of talking, some almost a little bit too much talking, a lot Ooh. of exposition, there as if a... they were setting up like a larger arc. They were huge, exquisite. like the whole, like the beginning part. Definitely, yeah. like it was just a lot. Of you dialogue. did, you did tell they tried to keep it interesting fine. to look at, like um, mm. when they're in the car uh-huh. driving, and he would, it would always cut to him doing uh, Hito or somebody doing something a little different, like his yeah. hand out of the car, like something like that, yeah. which I really appreciate. I love that kind of uh-huh. stuff. That scene did last a little too long, though. Mm-hmm. Um, and what, what else? A lot of tell don't show. Especially yeah, yeah, think. that's true. Um, well, you, you have to like try to explain all this red ribbon i know bullshit. yeah i know they but, it's not like they did a bad job with while it. it's pre-established it right. you mm. have to explain why where the hell it's been for the last yeah four, it wasn't like years. a bad job yeah. but it just was like all right i want to get to like the real meat and potatoes mm. i feel yeah. like the yeah. fighting there could have been we could have seen gohan's new form dragged out a little longer like, you know him, Broly, how yeah. Gogeta came out. He didn't just whip Broly immediately. He kind of got to have a little light in the a sun bit, a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. It was kind of like a, a Super Gogeta moment where, like, he showed up, beat his <laughs> ass, and called then, it a day. Yeah. But his Gohan just kind of like, ouch, that almost tickled. <laughs> <laughs> now it's my that. turn. <laughs> it, it almost felt like, too, like, why did like Piccolo doing the, like, when Piccolo did his arm wrap things? I was like, dude, you're just getting in the way. Like, uh, I think Gohan can handle this. Well, he did help at the very end. He like held his head up, but mm-hmm. but at the, but I'm like, did he really need to? Yes. I feel like Gohan could have just like boop and just like did it. There was no reason he had to do that except for thematic purposes, right? 
I'm not saying I didn't like what but came out of cool. it. It looked cool, right? Yeah. Also, that orb attack that Cell did. Oh, it was like super cool. Yeah. It was like it expanded. It was like a callback to like uh, Frieza and Kula because mm. they're they had similar energy attacks. Were just Cell <laughs> copying it. Yeah, yeah Cell copying it. I like again. how it showed it come out of like how it looked from yep. the perspective of the Earth. And then condensed, uh-huh. which made it really seem a lot more powerful. Right? And when yeah, it clashed, result. all like the colors, it's like pretty. Great Ooh. color work sometimes yeah. in this movie. Uh-huh. You know? mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Anyway, that's mine that I can think of. I'll say more if I remember. Okay. Colby. Really want me to go. You're like, Ooh, I do it. Do you all right, fun here to we watch. go. Here <laughs> it is. fun to watch with you guys. All right, here, here are my thoughts. Uh-oh. Lay it on us. I did not really like this movie. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Listen, I think this movie had a really big problem where uh, it's very disjointed Mm. thematically. There was so many things that it wanted to do uh, and a lot of little callbacks and everything. And everything is just so much out of reach and they couldn't align anything properly. Like the themes of like why cell is here, the, the androids, Gohan and Piccolo's journey throughout this movie, you could tell they wanted to make a lot of parallels to who they were in Dragon Ball Z and bring that back with like Piccolo Pan and all that, but they never finish any of them in a satisfying way. It really culminates to when they try and do this really fan servicey moment where Gohan the ching, the red the red line um, yeah, thing. Yeah, that was dope. There were no it looked great, but to me it felt hollow. Because um, there were no real states. Like we, when that happened in OG Dragon Ball Z, like we lost a character. We lost sixteen, mm-hmm. and that meant a lot of different things. Like obviously, Gohan and sixteen weren't close, but it meant a lot of different things to him. Nobody for any second believed that Piccolo was dead yeah. in this movie, right? Yeah. Um, and it just felt like okay, we have to get Gohan to break. How do we do that? Oh, Piccolo, there you go. <laughs> um like okay whatever uh to me it was trying to hit all these beats again and i but when i was driving home or driving here i just started to realize i felt like and this is the, the nature of fan service and a lot of people resonate with it and maybe it's just me personally i don't i just felt like i was getting tugged in this direction they were really trying to pull me in this certain direction in really cheap ways um and i just wanted something more substantial from what was happening um there are a lot of oh great that's oh dude that looks sick cool moment but it's it's sugar it's, and, and it, it's sugar. sugar yeah it's these <laughs> sugary treats um that once you get them your body doesn't get anything out of it right so i left this movie feeling um like oh that's why i thought it was fun i like eating candy mm-hmm. i don't feel really great about it or anything about it after um i just feel kind of crashed a little and um everything wraps up so quickly and in a messy kind of way who cares about gamma 2 i like, care we saw these gamma dudes two. for like six minutes right like the whole everything was just an excuse to get them to this one place um and i can't help but compare it to the broly movie like this is inevitable especially for me because uh-huh. i love like the broly movie was is everything I want out of Dragon Ball. It has like emotional context to it and ties. It elevates their character, like every character in it, uh, to to some sort of degree. The the focus, uh, it's really a focused movie. This movie did not have any focus to it. Um, is it about Gohan? Is it about Piccolo? Is it about Pan? I don't know. Why is Cell here? Because they want you to make. They want you to feel the way you felt during the end of the cell saga no way that was ever going to happen cell max is boring as shit he's just another he's like a less interesting harutagon he just comes Mm. out and he just yells Mm. and if you love spectacles and that's what a lot of people watch dragon ball for is a spectacle awesome love it you're gonna love this movie um i don't think there's any takeaway from this movie i just don't think so that's just how i feel so what he's saying is he wanted the Raditz version. <laughs> Elite Raditz. <laughs> Super Saiyan 6 Raditz. I would have, Blake knows, I would have walked out of that theater <laughs> if Raditz showed up. Um, those are fair points. I mean, mm-hmm. you definitely write about, and I was mentioning to, to Blake, I was like, I wish Cell had more 
I don't know, some personality. Blake was like, he wasn't finished yet, which is like true, but he just yelled a lot and That's the know, that's the just... thing, right? It like that what I said is like everything was there within reach. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But the movie never really makes a an effort to actually pull everything together. It quickly tries to. It quickly yeah. like tries to have Dr. Hedo explain like he made these androids to save the day or whatever and they're supposed to be superheroes and Oh but yeah. it, it, he's still also made Cell Max at the same time, so it's like Let's um I don't know. Let's also my biggest biggest flaw. How are you gonna have Gohan in this movie call it Dragon Ball superhero. Let's see where this is going. And you don't have any, not even a picture, a little news thing <laughs> of the great Saiyan man. Are you shitting me? I think that was a good call. I can't Missed believe opportunity it. I can't sure. believe yeah. it. Yeah. I was hope I was telling Blake this movie. It could have been shit, but if the very end, that post credit scene was Gohan is great Saiyan man. Uh, Videl is Great Saiyan Woman, you know, Great Saiyan Man 2. And then you have a little yeah. dressed up as a Great Saiyan Man 3 mm-hmm. yeah. little pan. Like a little That'd Halloween really party cute. or something. And then, like, they would have been like, imagine, like, they weren't fighting crime or whatever, but, like, they're in a room, whatever. And they're like, all right, Piccolo, we have one for you. And he's like, no way. <laughs> and then it ends. Like, like that would have been mm-hmm. so fun and cute yeah. and adorable. Yeah. But of course, Piccolo or fucking Goku and Vegeta gotta steal the goddamn show. <laughs> At Vegeta least had like to get that W and win. Yeah, that's true. Like Resurrection so, F or something. So yeah, that those are my thoughts on uh-huh. really harsh as they might be. Um, oh, but, they, are. they are. Yeah, yeah. But Blake, what do you think? Um, well, I'm glad one of us here is the intellectual, looking into the deep meanings. <laughs> It's... I don't give a goddamn <laughs> yeah. that shit. I want That's I fair. wanna see some cool shit. Yes. Some some fucking some funnies. Lots some, of fun. Some, just a fun time. Yes. And that's what I got. A mm-hmm. Dragon Ball mm-hmm. Super mm-hmm. Super Duper Hero. It's true. That, that, that's what I said. Yeah. I had fun watching it with you guys. I really did. Some some neat lore You even dumps. recommended it earlier. I do. Yeah. I, mm. I don't think this is a bad movie. Mm. I just don't like it. That's fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Okay. Um, okay. I thought it was cool, and I liked it. Yeah. I'll, I'll definitely buy it for Blu-ray. I will always remember the shot of him doing the special beam cannon. Absolutely, uh-huh. sir. That's definitely like, one of the huge takeaways. It's just so cool. I like... I'm glad this movie didn't look like crap. Yeah, like I thought. I thought it was gonna look awful. Like from day one. From day one, yeah, I thought I this movie too. was gonna look like trash. Yeah, I did too. Um, would we want another movie in this style? No, no. I want it in that style no. that they kept showing sometimes. Yeah, right. I want it back in the Broly style. Yeah, if uh, the if, not CG Broly. If this movie was like, if um, it wasn't the same director, right? No. Yeah. God, if we could have got him back. Shintani. Yeah, if we got all that back for this movie, I would not. This Your would opinion be a, probably would. This be would different. be an entirely different conversation, right? Yeah, now. I think they would have really sold it. Yeah. This is yeah. Um, this just felt like an episode of Super, but better. Mm. It felt like a condensed arc. <laughs> yeah. Super. Um, I yeah. mean, the, the I mean they've but turned is... two movies into arcs. So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, oh God, I don't want to see an arc of this. Like uh. uh super like if they were whatever they made super duper <laughs> whatever that show is if uh-huh. they like put this into like episodes oh that's gonna suck i don't think it's gonna do well well they have expand to do it. the manga shit first yeah they have a lot of shit to do mm-hmm. but it's um, gonna be dragon ball pan got yeah, pan really was she's gonna be the, the strongest saving one. grace of this movie to yeah. me i think everything about her was so great more than, more than piccolo Oh no, you're right. Piccolo was actually really great. In Piccolo this carried Piccolo a lot was of actually movie. yeah, he really did he carry really this. Carry movie. A lot of Piccolo movie. the movie. He had a lot um, of I'm, I'm telling with you, it. he had a lot yeah. of character development, uh-huh. like little character development. Yeah, yeah. Gohan was cool too. Like I really liked Gohan in this. Yeah. Um, Boma's ass. That was great. Boma's she, she's a great character. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> Go tanks his ass. Hobo, hobo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, another thing. They fuse again at the very end uh-huh. and didn't show yeah, it. Was... I... What the hell is that? They're like, we did it correct this time. I, I thought he was going to be like, oh, fly up with Pan, and they were going to fly, you know, they're like playing together. Yeah. Like, oh, that's cute. 
I leaned over to Blake. I was like, yo, they did it. He's like, they're not going to show it. Yeah. yeah <laughs> like, they what didn't the show it. What a, what a waste on that. I was like, why didn't they? He goes, because fuck you. That's why. <laughs> yeah. Krillin and 18. What are they doing here? Well, Krillin did the solar flare. And he, oh, and he yeah. threw he did the, the destructive, destructive disc. Saving 18, 18 had to be there to relive some trauma. <laughs> she was like, come on. They, <laughs> you know what? She really, they really could have done a little bit more with that. I was saying that exact same thing. Like, I was saying that, like, even just by animation style. I would have loved even at just a point where, like, Cell shows up and charges at her, and she's, like, stunned. She's yeah. like, oh, I, I, I can't do this again. Starts I, freaking out. I yeah. cannot. Yeah, it really has that, that PTSD yeah. moment. Because that and was then the form the, that absorbed her. Yeah, yes. yeah, yep. exactly. Yeah, right. That's yep. a good point. And, and then she, the Destructo disc would show up, and mm-hmm. then, you know. Before the Ooh. Destructo disc showed up, if you notice, his tail was up in the air. Oh. As he approached her, mm. just like when he yeah. walked towards her. I think they could have held that a little bit longer. They, yeah, I um, agree. They could have really played with that. I think, yeah, missed opportunities a bit in this movie. They um, fucked up. Yep. Big time. <laughs> Don't watch. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think um, think those are our final thoughts, gentlemen, before this goes over an hour. We're going to have uh, three words to end Eat by each of us. Three words. Brian, go. Are they connected or disconnected? It doesn't matter. Anything. I don't want to go first. You go first. Yeah, you go first. Super big recommend. (laughs) You're here to hear, hear, folks. Colby. I'm thinking. Uh, Hollow but fun. Lame Coley. I mean, Brian, who are you? <laughs> I'm sorry, um, big dick energy. Yeah, <laughs> justice for boo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Brian. Man, thank for you for watching thank this you. movie. Thank you. Um, uh, yeah, go watch uh, Dragon Ball Super, super Superhero. Super, um, it's super, it's, it's some- duper, it's something. It's not rabbits. <laughs> nope, it's not rabbits. <laughs> like, Uh, yeah, it's calling. I'm gonna answer. Everyone's gonna have a good time. Yeah, I'm gonna be at the movies and something. Season out, you think we're time. Got it. Oh yeah, he wasn't actually finished. It was a fake out. Everybody knows that I'm a. A bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Keep